guys, it's Kat here and welcome back to my channel. Apologies, my face is very red right now. That's, ooh, lots of dark eyes. This is what you call lockdown, <laughs> lockdown face, I don't know, with no makeup and but baggy eyes. So welcome to a day in my life in lockdown vlog. It's been a while since I've done a vlog and I really, at this point, wanted to do a day in the life and a week in the life vlog which will be coming soon really for me just to look back on how my life was like when I was in lockdown and to remember this time I definitely want to get into more vlogs because I feel like at this point I have something to look back on and vlogs are great for preserving memories so definitely want to do more vlogs coming up I will have more time later on today to sit down and really flesh this out and talk about it a bit more but it is a busy day so let's get started For a little bit and we didn't really get to talk that much last time so I thought that, that we didn't um, well I thought that we could talk and get to know each other better I'm pregnant Off. what what I'm pregnant with emotion with a baby you're the father and I'll have a coffee. Black. Keeping it lean for the ladies. I've been a coder long enough. It's time to broaden my horizons. Ooh, that's good. You should lead with that. I am done with my classes for the day. My brain is fried and I feel very tired mentally already, but I'm not done. I still have to do my self tape to hand in this week and well, I think first I need to have a nap. <laughs> yes, I am wearing glasses as well. These are blue light filter glasses which have really helped me a lot in terms of looking at the screens and because um, I'm staring at the screen almost the entire day for almost every day of the week because if I'm not studying then I'm online at work. No, when I'm not online work, then I'm researching and editing um, videos. I really should have gotten these for the first lockdown, but I didn't, so I got them for the second lockdown. So I have had a big rest now. You can probably hear mum having a meeting outside, because outside, just out of my room, is our desk area, work area. So usually, if I'm only working on Fridays, I will roll out of bed and turn on the laptop, and that'll be starting work and then getting changed while the laptop's booting up um but i've gotten changed into a nicer top for my self tape and i now need to put makeup on so i'm actually going to put my mini ears so that i can actually have everything out of my face so time to get spruced up for self tape <laughs>
set up my lights and everything for my self tape. I've got my makeup on, I've got my light. That's where my phone's gonna be because I don't trust the camera <laughs> yet. Don't trust myself with a camera yet. Uh, I've got my microphone that I'm gonna connect to my phone. My laptop's here, ready to play my music. And I've got my blank wall to do everything with. So I'm gonna film my self tape. I'm gonna edit it tonight. I'm gonna make sure that I get it in because it's due tomorrow by 12 p.m. Completely forgot after recording it the first time to plug in my mic. Right as bald in the shirt, is that the same? I don't know. <laughs> piece by piece, you filled the holes that you burned in me at six years old. And you know, this is not going well. So I'm done, finished filming. And pop is a lot harder for me than um, regular musical theatre, so not easy, very challenging, but I'm happy with the outcome. I'm very happy with it. Time to edit! Hey guys, so while my videos are uploading to my computer so I can actually, you know, update them. Sorry if you can hear my dogs barking outside, they're being... They're being my dogs. <laughs> but I thought this was a good time to actually have the sit down chat and give you an update on what's actually going on. So we have been in and out of lockdown twice now. This is our second lockdown in Melbourne and it has really... <laughs> yeah, there's not many words that you can use to describe it. Probably a whole lot of words, but I'm going to be polite and not use them. Honestly, it has thrown my head for a loop and mentally it has been such an up and down game. And there were a lot of days where I honestly didn't feel like doing anything. I just wanted to lie down and stay in bed. There was, I remember one day I actually, oh, getting emotional. I remember one day when I actually felt so bad that mum came in and she tried to talk to me and I couldn't even express the words to say how I felt and how horrible I felt. It was like all the words were up here, but they could have not actually get out and trying to find the words but then not being able to say anything and then out of nowhere I just started crying like there was no tomorrow and I don't mean like crying weeping I mean like screaming sobbing crying like where your mouth is open and your throat is hurting like that kind of crying only been maybe once really once that I felt that before it through me how much this actually affected me. The last vlog I actually did was when we moved to Melbourne and it was great looking back on the vlogs and seeing what I did in my last week and seeing how happy I was. And there were really a lot of quotes being thrown around when I was contemplating, do I keep doing YouTube? Do I keep uploading stuff? And to be honest, I wanna upload stuff so I can see the experiences that I've been through. I know that I'm in the middle of studying and I hope to one day professionally be in musical theatre and that is one of my biggest goals. And my other big goal is to travel as well. I have so many travel plans and looking back on the photos of the last trip I did was to New York. That was my last overseas trip and honestly, I felt so happy looking back on those and it made me really, I'm getting emotional. It made me really want to do vlogs of, even though this time, like it's such a hard time. I really want to document it so I can see how, where I was at this point and then see how I've grown. Ah, I'm crying. Sorry, I'm an emotional mess. I'm sorry, I'm an emotional mess. But yeah, I really want to continue um, doing vlogs and uploading music. It took a lot to upload that first song, my Cinderella song. Um, I will link it down below so you guys can have a look at it. It took a lot and I was umming and ahhing a lot about uploading that and I really felt happy once I did. Kind of went, I did it. I uploaded it and that's it. <laughs> I uploaded it. 
it's out there. I think always that first video is so hard. Yeah, I want to see my journey and one of the biggest things that I've learned through life is you got to take as many videos and take as many photos as you can because memories can fade so easily. And I want to have a way of looking back on my life, seeing how far I've come and seeing the happy memories, but also not so good memories as well. This is a really deep and emotional talk that I was not prepared for. Ah, emotional talks. God, gotta love them. But feelings are good. Feelings are good. Express yourself. Let's get back to editing. <laughs> editing and it's handed in yay an assignment that's due on time everybody loves that especially the teachers yay doing some dance academy throwback to my high school days when it came out gotta love it also i don't think you guys have officially met my two beautiful girls this is mia baby they're both so sleepy hello Hey baby, you're beautiful. Yes you are. Oh, big yawns. Big yawns. Oh, oh there she goes. She wants a tummy. And this is Bella. Yes. There you are. Yes you are. Little rascal. And my two beautiful girls. Yes. My two beautiful girls. So I'm gonna end the vlog here because the only thing I'm gonna do from now on is since I finish this episode of Dance Academy, I'm gonna put these girls to bed. I'm gonna go upstairs, I'm gonna have a shower, take my makeup off and do my skincare and my teeth and go to bed and collapse. Also I'm gonna do some journaling. If people don't follow her on Instagram, follow Carrie Hope Fletcher. She's one of the most amazing West End performers and she does a journal along with me on Instagram every day and we're up to I think day 17. It's been amazing for my mental health during lockdown. I don't know what I would have done if I hadn't found it. Thank you so much for following me today and for watching this vlog. If you like this vlog, please give it a big thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and click the bell to get notified for my latest videos. I'm gonna have some more song covers coming and some more vlogs coming. I really want to make these memories and keep them with me at all times. Love you guys. Bye.